This is a 2011 MY12. 1F, 155 TSI, two liter turbo. This is the Sport Edition. Six speed DSG automatic transmission. Second to rear muffler has been removed and a straight bit of stainless steel pipe has been put back in. Is it the right system for you? Let's find out. Right, so that was a takeoff test, standing start. You do notice the pop and the crackle and the burble in between the changing of the DSG gear system um, all the way up through uh, and on the way back down, especially if you're driving it manually. But this is the exhaust system from inside the car. I'm using the Rode Wireless Go system. This microphone is actually a sensational audio device, especially for this kind of environment. So I'm just gonna sit this right in the middle of the car, go for a drive. As you can tell, you probably can't hear the exhaust system. That's at 60 kilometers an hour. I'm just gonna pull over here and uh, we're gonna do a test of what it sounds like like going past, what that sound would be like if you were just to drive past and if, if you had a bystander on the street. Two tests, first test, driving normal. Second test, a little bit more aggressive than normal. See, it's actually quite sporty, but when you're just driving it normal, it's actually quite subtle. All right, now we need another test. I'm gonna try and strap this GoPro to the back of the car so you can kind of hear the exhaust from outside from the back. Alright, so that's from the outside. Let's get back on the inside. I'm going to clip the microphone to the back seat belt. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to clip the seat belt together. The microphone is clipped to the seat belt in the back of the vehicle. So this is just driving around normally what it would sound like if you were actually in the back seat of the EOS. these country roads. It's just 60 kilometers an hour. So the microphone is now up here on the sunroof liner, the, the actual, the hood liner, just behind where the sunroof shuts. And uh, let's drive it with the windows down, and see if it makes any difference. Windows down. It's gonna make a bit of a difference with the windows down because you are gonna get a lot more sound coming from the exhaust system. But, if you just drive it normally, it just sounds like a really nice sports exhaust. However, obviously if I give it some stick, you're gonna notice a bit of a difference in the sound. So let me just flick it back to manual. Get back into a gear that has a bit of oomph in it. So 
So I suppose one of the last tests you might want to know is what's it actually like with the roof down? Obviously you're going to hear it a lot more with the roof down. That's just common sense. But it's not terrible. Okay, let's put the microphone somewhere central. Um, you know what? I'm going to put it up here on my shoulder, which is about central to the vehicle. I'll do this fairly. So it's kind of facing into the back. Uh, normally first, just zero to 60 to 70 kilometers an hour at a normal speed. Urgency, let's say urgency. So that's up to about 80 kilometers an hour. Nice little burbles, but it's not disgusting. So this is at 100 kilometers an hour on the highway, roof down. You barely hear the exhaust, even when you get up it. You don't really... It's a subtle exhaust system. Uh, we'll take the next exit, and then what I'm going to do is just pop my head under with the GoPro and just try and show you what actual, which muffler I took off. Um, yeah, so it's the second from the rear muffler that I had taken off and put a straight bit of pipe in. The only extra expense was due to the fact that VW systems have to have a slip ring inserted. You can't weld the system. It has to have this specially designed VW slip extension. Um, and I'll show you that underneath. But she's a ripper exhaust system. I'll, I'll try and hold it at three grand soon just to give you an idea and understanding like what that drone is at 3,000 revs. Let's hold this sucker at 3,000 revs and I'll show you what I mean about the only drone that you get in this exhaust system. Try and hold it at three. Right there. Right, so that's the back of the car there. There used to be, the second from the rear muffler used to be here. So basically they take that muffler out. As you can hear, there is a slight burble just on idle. But it's not terrible. It's actually quite a subtle exhaust system when you're driving normal. So thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to know anything more about the VW EOS, this is our pride and joy. I love making videos, so if you want to know anything else, put a comment below. Hope this video has been helpful. We love the exhaust system on this car, have not been disappointed, and it was a very simple process. You don't have to spend a lot of money to get your car to sound amazing. Anywho, I think I've annoyed this neighbourhood enough with the exhaust system so catch on the next video